Welcome back. So today's challenge is to be spontaneous. And so you might know that being spontaneous can be kind of exciting. But you, what you might not realize is the reason why we enjoy when something happens spontaneously. And that's because we have this really strong need for certainty and security and stability. But what happens when our life is routine and stable is that we start to get bored and restless and everything feels mundane. And so we have this other counterbalancing need that makes us want to be uncertain, that we need variety in our life. And that's where spontaneity comes in because without it, life is just really drab and boring. And so if you're looking to add more happiness to your life, you're going to have to shake things up a little bit. And part of the reason for that is because when you're doing something that's outside of your comfort zone, it causes a little bit of confusion. And when your brain is in a state of confusion, it opens up your mind to things that you wouldn't have thought of, that you wouldn't have seen. And it puts you in a good place to learn and it puts you in a good place to see life in a different way. And so the challenge for today is to ask yourself if there's any ways that you could change up your routine a little bit, even if it's something very simple. Because a small change in your routine, what it does, it kind of puts you on edge. It makes you think about it. You turn something that's an unconscious process, like for example, your process for getting ready in the morning. You do exactly the same thing every day. So if you just change the routine a tiny bit, even as simple or as silly as brushing your hair before you brush your teeth instead of the other way around. If you do something simple like that, what it does is it takes this process that has become unconscious and it makes you be conscious about it. You're doing it with a level of awareness that you normally don't do. And so that gives you a little bit of variety. So the next challenge is to take it a step further and to plan some sort of event or trip that is either outside of your comfort zone or just something you normally don't do that can break up the routine of your week or your month, ideally within the next two weeks so you have something to look forward to that again adds a little bit more spice to your life. And then the last thing is to challenge yourself today to do something spontaneous, anything, something that puts you outside of your comfort zone, shakes things up a bit. Even if it's something like, you know, you take a different route home and you take a random road you've never seen before and go down that street and see if anything is new or exciting. It can be very, very simple. Or you can, you know, go all out and do something crazy. It's really up to you. Now, everybody values spontaneity and variety differently. Some people really have a high level of variety and spontaneity in their life because that's how they like it. Well, other people tend to really want things to be routine and secure. And so there's a spectrum, but no matter where it is that you are on the spectrum, by changing things up in your life and doing something spontaneous, you're going to bring a lot more joy and excitement into your daily life, especially today.